my newest quad. It's a uh, frame is a Grasshopper 160. Um, <laughs> I got the voltage alarm just kind of taped on there or strapped on the outside, but things being to look kind of like a ball. Um, this is my smallest quad yet. It has uh, fairly good sized motors, uh, 1806 by uh, 2300 kV uh, DSYs. I have a NAS uh, 32, um, I think it's an SP racing uh, control board in there, and I have the FlySky uh, receiver, that's the B, that could bring back telemetry. Uh, I'm flying PPM with just one, um, one uh, I guess it's three wires, brings back six channels, all six channels. So with that, I'll plug this in, turn the radio on. Sure, yeah. Model 3. Let's make sure I'm... I lifted it up last night in the living room just to make sure it worked. It seemed to work pretty good. It has three flight modes or rates that are selectable. Um, angle, uh, horizontal, and arrow or rate. Um, We'll start it off in uh, angle mode. Okay, looks like it's bound. Whoa. Yeah, I was doing that last night. It's a little jittery. Probably the PIDs need to be adjusted. Although when I put it in... Uh, horizontal mode that got rid of a lot of that shakiness. Battery looks huge on there. A little shaky. Ooh, this is icy out here. It's hard. <laughs> it looks like snow, but it's ice. Simple back and forth, hover up. More power, about 40% sending it up. So 35% throttle, it's about neutral. Let's just see what this thing will do. Whoa. So the propeller stopped when I turned it down to zero. I put one shot on it. I'm not used to that. <laughs> one shot, uh, when you turn it to zero throttle, it stops the propeller's dead. So you're able to drop the quad faster. Okay, I think I'll keep it an angle for a little bit more. Kind of cruise around nice and slow. Get it a little lower here. Okay, put it in the second mode. Whoa, 
Uh oh, I don't know if I like that. Just gotta get used to it. That's the horizontal mode. A lot less shaky. Let's just kind of go back and forth and see what it does. I don't know if you could do a loop in the horizontal mode. But I'm gonna just kind of run it around. Yeah, it seems to be a little bit smoother, a lot smoother. Yeah, I like this mode. A lot nicer. It's a pretty good angle. This thing spins pretty good. Let's see what the yaw is. Well, not real good. Here's yaw, full yaw. Might want to increase that a little. But it dips fast if you roll it, roll it back and forth, pitch forward, back. It's quite responsive. First time out flying. First time ever using a NAS board. it a little. Install it out. Those motors are nice. They don't make much noise. They're a little heavier. And I thought they'd be, I don't know if they didn't include the weight of the prop connectors or the shafts. They screw on separate. But they were 25 grams a piece. Might have saved a gram or so trimming the wire, maybe two grams. I didn't weigh them after I trimmed the wire. That was without the prop nuts. There's a nice bank. Oh. It's been up pretty while long. I didn't I'll know what the time is when I look at the uh, video. need to attach the uh, voltage battery wire to the uh, control board. Whoa! Ooh, something fell off. My voltage <laughs> meter. No. In the battery. <laughs> okay. Well, not a bad first flight, considering. Propellers all look good.